Hey guys, this is the Gaming Seed with part 31 of the Pokemon Black Walkthrough. Uh, in this part, we're going to be going further up in the Celestial Tower. Last time we left off in this place, and now we're hopefully going to finish it. Probably, probably not. And wow, Swaloon versus Leaveny. Whatever, let's just bug bite it and be done. Whatever. And this should bring us to level 35. Did I take the lucky egg off of, um, Ember? I think I did off screen. Let me just check that one real quick. Okay, there, I just did. There. It's done. Uh, I think this is Willowisp TM? Yes, it is. TM61, Willowisp. It is a burning move. Um, I already fought you. Fought you in the last video. Let's just go up the stairs. Oh, spiral staircase. And we have some psychics to fight. A Pokemon trainer. Well, I'm in a world full of Pokemon. You think I'd be a trainer? God, these people of 2011 are bigger dumbasses than I thought. Anyway, we're just gonna have to fight this Musharna. Not too big. Well, actually, Musharna is pretty big. And Lucky Chant is gonna shield her from crits. Not that it's gonna matter, because you are dead. Yeah, Leaving you will be getting a lot of experience in this place just because it's the only one on my team that's, you know, has good moves against psychic types. Okay, just sneak around and get a spell tag. That's going to power up your ghost type moves. And let's just fight some more trainers. Psychic Bryce with Duozian. In case you don't know, Duozian is the evolution of Solacis, which eventually evolves into Reuniclus. Um, what is that supposed to be anyway? Oh, oh, I'm almost 36. 36, and this time I'm sure Levini will be getting a pretty nice move, you know. Let me test out Don't Eat Me the Vanillish now that it is a vanillish. And it's evolved. And that other stuff. Okay, she has Gathita. So here we go with vanillish. Just ice beam off the start. Wow, one hit. Crit. I don't think that mattered. Um, Elamamala, water type. Uh, you know, I'm gonna try Sigilyph. Sigilyph hasn't been getting a lot of experience lately, and I feel kind of bad about it. I mean, I do only need to get up another level, but look at it. I mean... Vanillish is mid-35, Levani's almost 36, Embor is 36, or else it wouldn't be an Embor, and Sigilyph is only beginning level 34. I mean, I do like to have very even teams in these games, and should I mirror it? No, I'm not going to mirror it. And just go for the side beam, and aw, oh, you suck. Balls, you look like two health, maybe, and just mirror move it, I guess. Are you shitting me? A hyper potion. I did indeed expect that to barely do anything. Ah, you protect noob, and I'm still confused. And here's where I hit myself. Now let the hurting of myself begin. Got 
that thing this thing is just like slowly chipping me down if I actually die and then you protect yourself okay there got a side beam off and now water pulse okay good you didn't confuse me Okay, now you're just making this battle go longer than it needs to. I have a time limit, you know. Well, I don't really have a time limit anymore. I did get the increased time, but still, I like to make these videos shorter than they kind of need to be because that's the way I do things. That's the way I get through walkthroughs. I mean, this is only the first one and all, but... And I will be getting a better camera. And just seeing it. Oh, no, the nurse healed. Psh. I forgot that nurses heal you in this game. I'm so dumb right now. Just like earlier today in school, I forgot it was Tuesday instead of Monday. And... Oh, I was going to upload part 30 today. But no, I don't have any time. <sighs> Ah, sorry. Just had to sneeze there. I was gonna upload this today. I'm just gonna upload parts 29 and 30 today, but I never did. So, this psychic here just has a Yamask here. Or Yamask, or Yamask, or whatever. I was actually, I was actually considering using Kefagragus. Now, Hex is an interesting move. And this is a good combo with like Litwick and Yamask. Yeah, Will O Wisp and Hex. Because what Hex does is it's a 50 power special ghost type move. And it does double the damage if your opponent has a status like burn, poison, paralyze, freeze, whatever. And now that I'm through that. Yamask fainted and leaving your girl level 36 and it's going to be learning leaf blade and I'm gonna get rid of razor leaf because well leaf blade is more powerful and it has the same secondary effect of having a high crit ratio um golet ground and ghost mmm you Yeah, Gorg is actually really good and really underrated. Um, it's what this thing evolves into at like level 43. Um. Oh yeah, I already fought you. Okay, whatever. I'll get through as much of the battle as I can with Leaveny, and then I'll just father it, I guess. And bring in what's appropriate. Okay, Psychic Lynn. Ooh, Litwick. Ghost and Fire type. Litwick is a very good special attacker. It evolves at level 41 into Lampent and then evolves by Duskstone into Chandelure. Very, very good, in my opinion. Very good to have on a team that doesn't already have a ghost or fire type. I love it a lot and oh god Hex is gonna kill me. Yep. And oh, actually no I'm gonna go to Sigalot just to finish the thing off. Cause Sigalot does need experience comparing to the rest of my team just side beam I guess. Um, Swoobat. vanilla -ish time. Oh, that may make it so it'll be able to live through an ice beam. I'm not sure, though. 
Okay, it didn't. Okay, um... Well, I guess I could end the part here. Next time, we're going to be getting through floors 4 and 5 of Celestial Tower. And hopefully finishing it up. Okay, see you guys then.